morning, guys. All right. Checking out the update. I think the campaign is locked behind this, so uh, let's get to it. Waves of enemies will spawn throughout this mission. Look at that volume up in a second. Looks like they've changed their volume settings since last time we messed with it. Seems better. All right, so our win con. Claim the nearby keep and take, then find the dude, kill him. I have 45 turns to complete it. What are my... Uh, okay, nine available clan points. Do I have an extended? I do an extra tier. Good morning, Indodaki. You have returned. Thanks for the reset, Tom. Welcome back, man. Each spent point will give. Recruit action is now free. You think that's free in action costs? Must be. <laughs> oh, shit, Tom. Um, okay, I gotta remember to... I think the promo event for the... Uh, Tier two for the badge flare is done, so I think I can update the uh, badges to get the the ones that do good with the dark mode, which is nice. And Tom, we gotta freaking talk about this stupid crashing issue next time we chat, cause uh, I'm still not past it. It's still fucking crashing. Yesterday was such a ridiculous day in terms of crashes. All right, three cards. What's our army look like? We've got our hero Vlad. With Dire Bats, Awakened Adepts, Thin Blood Archers, Bat Swarm, Awakened Magus, and another Vampire Bat. Oh, we get to see the Tier 3 Vampire Bat. It's kind of interesting. Yeah. Good morning, Bill. Yeah, we're going to check this out today. Uh, they uh, they reached out to us and said uh, they have some codes for us to give away if we want. So, the crash at Wave 120. That was like the sixth crash yesterday, Angimar. It's so brutal. I don't know. Anyways, let's, let's hope that's not much of an issue today. All right, let's take a look. So I'm a pretty big proponent of Lifesteal as a skill card. I really like the four turn one. Um, Bloodlust is decent. I like the one that doesn't cost me any life. Blood Barrier is quite good. I liked the range on Blood Barrier. Still upgrading, huh? Drain life. Um, as the cheap cost was there. And Bloodstorm. Just damage was fine. Alright. So, we have our dude. If we beat this quest, we get access to the next campaign. So we're going to try to do that. Our negative, arm, negative income, unspent legacy points. Should I address this? Um... Nine. It's quite a lot. I really do like card selection. And Lord Power, of course, is just good. Alright, let's try this. 
We haven't changed a whole lot of this, I don't think. Actions. Building actions for you is really nice as well. I wonder if I can get that first. We have 45 turns or less, so I don't feel like investing in infrastructure is going to be super good here, but... Go all the way up to labor slaves for now. And where are these? I wanted to see what that was. Do we take a point in uh, nightly aristocracy? Probably not. Maybe fill the middle stuff in here. And go from here up into champions too. All right, I'll take one in nightly aristocracy. All right, where is our dude? Let's take the village. The village has no one in it or no stuff to bleed. All right, what is this? A ritual site. What is the ritual we gain? We get a better sacrifice. We have one in hand, so it's worth 10 blood. Hey, dehydrogenase, good morning. Uh, let's get this volume up a little bit. I seem to have massively reduced overall uh, noisiness of the game. Okay. All right, the ritual site guarded by a couple, actually a fairly large army. Mostly weak units though. Zombie, zombie, skeleton, skeleton. I don't know what these things do. These new units? Maybe. Well, there's only one way to find out. I could also upgrade this while we're here, I suppose. We do upgrade for free, we might as well. Repair. Oh, but repairing apparently is not building. <laughs> and although we have free building, we don't have free repairing. How many actions do we have left? One. Disappointing. But now we can construct. Okay, so we actually not only had to take it, but we had to then uh, repair it. All right. Uh, we are going to upgrade this. Max pop. First turn. Actually attacked us, interesting. Could auto resolve it, I guess, but we should probably fight it. Okay. Should you buy this? Well, we're giving away free codes all day today, Seawolf Sam. I would uh, stick around a little bit, decide what you think of it, see if you get a code and make your decision. All right. Follow your Lord's aspiration to rank up and gain additional bonuses. To level up, receive damage to rank up. Huh. Okay. It's new. It's a new feature of the Lord. Alright, what are the actual stuff? Oh, we lost our tooltip. Tells us what these do. That sucks. I don't remember what these ones do. All right, we've got some flying units, which I like. I haven't used them much, but I do like the fact they can move over terrain. Send Vlad running down the center. Get a couple of ranged units. Oh, dude, there's no voice confirmation right now. It's amazing. All right, we're missing some heavy melee. You wanna tell me what this does yet? No. It's too bad. Sh 
Should be able to see what happens. So, okay, restores. Overkill, soul tap. I think the soul tap is from that. Right. Teleport on the bats doesn't seem very useful on a flying unit. Command us, my lord. Oh. Everyone else got quieter, but you're just as loud, you bastards. All right. And spacebar was speed before, wasn't it? Am I just imagining that? What is this? I swear that was a hotkey last time. Archers. It's not. Oh, it's our bat. We serve the Sound level extra low from me or from the game? Because the game I've turned up four times already. Because we turned it down last time because it was insanely loud, and then I fired it up today after the new update, and it's really, really, really quiet. So you're just getting not very loud voice confirmations or are you hearing me as soft as well? No, they just literally released an update today. You mean stream sound. Is anyone else finding me particularly quiet today? Voice level is normal. Okay. Yeah, the game sounds very quiet right now. I'll fix that again. It doesn't seem to be giving me the option at the moment. All right, turn two. These archers, warriors, and zombies. Okay to just run in and kill that. Let's move archers into safe locations if we can. The power flows through us. You hear how loud this guy is still though? That wasn't changed, I guess. Alright, this is a large singular vampire vat. like to give this guy life steal and possibly bloodlust yeah exactly that one dude is super loud I've been a bit aggressive with that unit. I thought that was this unit here. I'd like to get another attack in here, but I blocked the unit I wanted. Blood is life. Is this this is our 
Level two bat. Half flank, full flank. Full flank seems great. We have our mages. This thing apparently is quite tanky. Or rather this bat swarm doesn't do shit for damage. Bats bite a ghoul, quite likely. All right, we get a full flank there, and if we drain it, we could probably kill it. Don't have to stand there, though. We can easily move out. We're much more mobile than they are. That's interesting. How do I attack from there and get a full flank? Can we stack flying units? Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> it was just standing literally in, in place. All right. I didn't quite realize what I was getting into with that. That's fine. Double guard's good for us. I bring the night. This guy's fairly loud too. Did my bats die? Oh, well, I must have had some sort of like dot kind of effect. Plague Cloud ability damages all non-undead units around the caster for 80% of base unit attack. So yeah, they basically ticked and killed my guy. All right, good to know. It has been too long. Undying. Don't know what that does. New ability. Haven't encountered it before. Presumably they don't get to do that indefinitely. Yes, my lord. Looks like it might have just been one extra life. Like this is a kind of nice level of unit responses from my perspective, especially Face if we turn. the might of the Dracul. Especially since some of them are so much louder than others. I don't know if we want to uh, turn the rest of the game sound up or not. So we lost our lowest level bats. Our lowest level bats are kind of garbage, but losing units is not great for us early. All right, that was them attacking us. We'll liberate the tile next round. Good morning, Billy. Twitch volume was lower, but the UI was something. Okay, I'm glad it wasn't on my unveil. I'm paranoid about my system settings these days after all the trouble I've been having. So I was ready to believe, I'm like, a regular member of chat who doesn't normally troll me is telling me something's wrong. It probably is something wrong. All right, claim one of these. We're getting both actually, right? Okay. Yeah. All right, our turn. I'm gonna take the ritual site, ups the power of sacrifice by owning it. Grab that. Our dude is slow. All right, I don't have to take these intermediate tiles before going for the keep. It's not like I'm gonna to get to reinforce that I'm aware of. So I think we'll just start moving that way. Uh, there's a graveyard that I can reinforce out of if I had uh, captured along the way, but I'm not going to. Just keep moving over. Are restless. Wigbrand must be truly desperate to make his way through here. I didn't notice we had a healing card. I think we do. I'm gonna auto resolve this one to not go through that. Take a little bit of damage. The biggest part of the biggest pain about auto resolve is it drains so much mana. 
Okay. Yeah, I did get a heal. Alright, I picked up a level up out of that too. Yearly card draw is coming up next turn, so having an extra yearly card draw might be nice. You can actually take that this turn too. Anything else that would help more immediately? I kind of want to see what these new ones do. I don't really know what each point, each spent point will now give recruit action free. And we were down here though to get um, champions and exalted, right? It's a nice one too overall. Keeps give blood, villages and cities max by one. I'm gonna take card selection for now. All right. Let's move forward. Story-wise, did all the lords you recruited last map abandon you? I think story-wise, um, you're kind of angry and chasing, I think. All right, there's the keep. Let's bathe in blood to heal. Uh, we're going to, thought I had a meditation. I do have a meditation. Let's re restore mana. Then we'll take the fight. Okay. All right. Huh. Are these bonuses only per fight then? Because these are different bonuses than... Uh... Last time I was supposed to take 150 damage and we didn't. Because they didn't attack our guy and I forgot about it. We should see what the happens with if I take these. We're supposed to do 200 damage with the Lord. I wonder if spells count. All units are army gain 10 attack. All units are army gain 8 armor. Ignores pain. So their leader is a big buff bot. So we want to focus him pretty hard if we can. Doesn't look like the tiles are very nice for moving in here. Maybe up that side. We can move Vlad up this side, I guess. Archers in here are all right if they come forward, which they might. And our bats are pretty, pretty. Actually, our bats are really good in this terrain since they can ignore it all. I think that's the retaliate one, but I don't remember. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, that's the retaliate one. This one is heals. Okay. This one gives me mana. Maybe we could set up over here instead. Get the archers on that. And the bats can be a little bit more picky. Since I don't have good blocker units in this army. Alright, let's try this. I'm really annoyed that spacebar no longer ups game speed and I have to move it up. At least I can do it on their turn. Enemy unit something suffers more damage, I guess. Okay. Seventy-two magic damage from the necromancer. It's quite a lot. Let's give life steal to Vlad. Such a much nicer level of volume from these guys, in my opinion. Okay, are they unable to move through there? No, there's a one tile over there. They're just not taking it. Starting to flank over there, and our bats are up. I don't know what we're doing with these bats. Maybe fighting one tile chokes over there. 
or attempting to. Okay. All right. Now that did actual damage to us. What was it? Decay. It loses 15% of max hit. Okay. If I can get in there and hit, it seems reasonable. We want a life steal. Our goal is to do 200 damage too. Let's move there. Could nuke the group. It's okay. Not amazing. Could uh, drain then kill it. Like that more. Okay. More debuffs on our archers. Good. This is the unit I want to kill most, so putting him in blood. front of Vlad is great for us. So much blood. Such great lions. All right, let's move in. Our lives for Dracul. Quietly. These lives, I hope. Yeah, that will actually cost us units if we don't deal with that. These units are fairly tanky and kind of annoying. I might just ignore them entirely and get the bats in on the necros. Archer has been pretty useless at the moment. Yeah, it's really bad news. One of our archers at like 10 health. All right, so what am I doing with these bats? I didn't even realize those were archers. Set up for the flank on this guy. You can't stop units from firing in this game. Take a bunch of damage doing that. Power before me. All right, we can probably kill here. Should be really nice for uh, each unit below 66% health. There's at least two. It's 30% damage enough to kill it. Maybe. You gotta rather just make sure he dies. All right. That's very low right now. We gain life attacking. Return. Teleport ability. I don't think so. Filthy bane and filthy bane and filthy bane. Thank you, Trippy. Welcome back. Alright. He goes next too? No, that unit goes next. Okay, let's set up this flank. Lost the unit there, annoyingly. Lost the two this unit. These are doing a lot of damage to us. I mean, they get skeleton archers out of killing us. That's not great. The blood gives us strength. More zombies, it looks like. I didn't recruit bats in the last campaign. They looked super squishy to me. And they're behaving like they're super squishy. Who would have guessed? <sighs> Clearing space here lets them attack us easier. Okay, we will heal off this. But not all that much. Of Aren't they the good guys? I don't know, I haven't played uh, Masquerade. It's just the next faction. There's three factions right now. And this is the only unlocked one. 
all shall serve. We're gonna lose like everything this fight. Oh, they just moved through their own unit to kill me. Oh my god, it's gonna be the Lord with no units left. All right, it's fine. I didn't want these bats anyways. So those aspirations were separate, huh? Based on what? Just 250 damage per aspiration? I wonder if these are permanent buffs or not. This is a new uh, new mechanic, this aspiration stuff. Or if these are just like temporary buffs you get during the mission. Why is our Lord Vlad? Uh, I don't know how to answer that. It's the main character. I don't see those buffs anymore. So presumably that was just for the, for the fight. All right. Uh, I am going to inspire to take this before the year end. I think we can get 2 AP here. Turn to decide if we want 4 AP or not. Kind of want to take that village as well. Before the year's end. So we'll claim. Such an inhospitable land. For Wickbrand to run here of all places. He must be up to something. Okay. Oh, we had 45 turns to get the first keep? No. No, okay, we have to get the ancient, okay, the whole thing. I will turn that volume up just slightly if we can't. <laughs> I don't know which one. Ambiances, sound effects, button clicks, music. It's gotta be this one, right? But I'm so dubious of changing the awakened mages to a louder, on what louder level. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Exactly that, triple V. All right, so we have the keep. And I can, I do have one more Inspire the Troop card. So we could move into the village, then repair it, and then take it. Which we kind of need to do. I would have liked to get them both before. I have, oh, mobilize is not what I thought it was. All right, so let's go here. We'll inspire again. Get our action two action points back. We'll claim the land. We'll repair the village. And then we'll upgrade it before the beginning of the year where all the uh, where all the changes happen. So we definitely want pop growth. And I want housing. And town hall. Okay. So we're at what do we actually have in the village though? Two, we'll go to five of five. And we have the ability if we want to pick up one more. Can make recruiting free action, which seems pretty good. Or we can unlock recruiting level three units. Eh, I think I'm gonna need level three units. So we'll end turn three. Could actually do this now. Is there an advantage to doing this now? There's not a limited number of units I can pull out and I have to pay for them. I think we just pass. Okay. More armies are approaching. We it's need like to hide four cards. before we get swarmed. Uh, that's a good one. Uh, that's a good one. I don't hate this either. Take these, I guess. Yeah, go ahead. 
go our first giveaway for this game, Tom. If you're interested in getting a copy of this game, listen to Tombulus in chat, our community manager. He'll tell you how you can potentially do that. All right, what do we want? We're gonna want some units out of the keep. I don't have to go through the keep to get them. Just go to the village, seems fine. All right. Let's grab a couple of these knights. I really like the knights. Just trying to decide if I want to, I should have upgraded the keep before I left for, um, oh, I can, I don't have, I haven't upgraded champions. I gotta go there anyways. Okay, so we'll go there. All right, 96 blood, which isn't very much, but whatever. Go ahead and construct a champion upgrade. We have this already? No, we had that one already, apparently. I don't have a construction card, right? No. Okay. All right. Now we can recruit. Am I going to use the 10% off there? How much? 40? I mean, I guess. Do I want to unlock the... No, I don't care about that. All right. Let's grab a couple knights. Warriors and Riders. The Riders still seem massively better than the Warriors to me. I wonder if any of these stats got changed or not. Take a Greater Sacrifice. Take another Recruit. Alright. Oh, I did not mean to recruit a Warrior that was supposed to be a fucking Rider. I guess we'll see. Rip. And let's go take the village. Call it a turn. Can I still have the system where patrons can recommend games? Uh, no, I have a Discord channel where any viewer can recommend games. Okay, I guess we're fighting with two men down. Uh, all right. Gains regeneration, gains 10 armor, gains blood drinker. Heal units using blood drinker, lifesteal, or death tap to rank up. Okay, all my units are dead here from a mismanaged first couple fights. What are we fighting? Fiends, zombies. This doesn't look actually that bad. Okay. Thanks, Billy. All right. I um, guess we run Blad through the middle, set up for a. Oh, it's not a. Okay. Our lives for Dracul. So these are in fight bonuses I can pick up. Do they have any archer units? Doesn't look like it. Blood is life. The blood calls. I crave more. It has been too long. Gotta give him life steal. Maybe that would have been worth. I don't want to block Vlad. Particularly, might still be a path around it though. Get a charge off. Did 
blocked, Vlad. Alright. Oh, it's because that's a non-accessible tile. Who knew? Okay. For the bloodline. I don't care about these passive these are the secondary objectives, right? They don't do anything. My lord. All right, let's get life steal on the lord. Go in here and start attacking. that thing Keep him off my archer oh lives for dracul Lord gains regeneration. Got a nice one tile choke here. I'm not sure I really want to get any closer. I don't like their Lord hitting aspirations though. At your service. Shockwave. It has been too long. My knights can handle their lord. I think maybe. That doesn't look great, though. Commander nice Spillor. tanky level 3 units and see. <laughs> to be one tile faster. I've been ref ref refusing to move over there, but I kind of wish I had now. Do you do magic damage, this guy? No, physical. Yes, my lord. Well, that sure looks like magical. We're gonna lose these units if we don't back them up. The Dracul shall rule over all. Don't want to lose tier three units. Supposedly we're faster than him. Maybe we can retreat. something here though I'm not gonna have to get everybody away how fast is he five can't 
Can't get the knight if I move it to there. Probably can get the archer though. It's too bad. The blood calls. I crave more. <laughs> Not sure we beat this thing. It seems to be life stealing through us. What does this do? Is this a regen? No, gives it blood drinker. I, mean, I can get a nice charge in here, but it's not good enough. I guess we keep running on the night. Turned. Hmm. Still loving your content. Thank you, uh, PWJ LaFontaine. I'm glad to hear that. Um. All right, we'll shockwave these guys, I guess. These tier three units as well. Tier two units doing really good damage to us. Shall serve. Lord gains shielded. So these things are very slow. those but it's a little sad not sure I can get away with these maybe running my tier 3 units as we try to get this set up. Dude, that unit heals for a lot. attack me so I don't get the counter attack and it's healing for like as much damage as I'm doing <sighs> I don't want a guard I don't want blood drinker all right we can't get ganged up on by the uh, those for the bloodline Can we put the Lord there and fight this? These regenerate too, right? Yes.
All right. The Dracul shall rule over all. Charge. Maybe get the knight out again, too. I was wondering if I can shockwave through here or not. Looks like I can. Does it hit my own guy? Sure does. Well, I don't know if I wanted to hit my own guy. At your service. Cower before me. Pretty close fight. Yes, my lord. Is there three movement, right? The Dracul shall rule over all. I'm trying to get a unit kill here and I don't want them to. Cower before me. All right, can they kill to heal here though? That would be nice. Looks like they can. Okay. Yeah, it was a bit of a pain. I had to work through the fact that their Lord was extremely tanky and came in on Mire. Nothing out of our guys could handle him except their own Lord. It was just basically like, try not to lose my units as my Lord butchers them all. All right, lost another unit though. Okay. Makes Blade and Blood better. I would like that location. Let's repair the village. Uh, we don't have shit for resources right now. I'm still building all of these, right? 1621. You guys saw the delay on Battle Brothers this morning, right? I tweeted to say basically that coronavirus is slowing down the production of that expansion. So, can't wait. It's going to have to be. You're probably going to have to wait. Just putting that out there. I heard about humankind. I don't know. Maybe. Okay, I like the werewolves a lot as a unit. I'm not sure we have the resources for it. What day? Turn six right now. All right, let's move into Wishing Stone. Claim it. Interact with it. Lord experience heals our army. Units to full health. Four action points. Okay. All right, let's claim this location. All right, nothing else around here, right? We'd have to build while we're here though, if I want to recruit level threes, and I do, I need a blocker unit. I like the werewolf. So that's a construct, we're at 18, oh, it's 24, seriously. Um. annoying can I elaborate on what games I'm considering in the near future or is that on a day-to-day -day basis um, you can check the sheet man the sheet's got planned games but it's a day-to-day -day what I'm playing on any given day I don't think there's a point in claiming that kind of need to heal can't heal in this location want to recruit 
only ones worth recruiting always are werewolves. Bummer. Any out for that? Looks like pretty much no. What happens if I split them here? Split army to there. You guys go there. You're out of movement. You're not. All right. Can I heal individually with this unit is what I was wondering. Can't heal, why not? Requires the Lord, I guess, to heal. It's kind of a bummer. Well, now we know. Probably need to full heal the army here. As who knows what comes out of the fog and attacks us. How many more have infested these lands? Alright, got consumed. We would have been really nice to have that. And immobilize. Another inspire. Okay. Alright. We're at full hand size, that's fine. There's a ritual site there with upgraded meditation, not bad. Okay, we just three per year could drain the far village. Uh, what are we turn eight in a while too? I need to recruit again. I kind of would like to recruit a tank gear unit. Uh, it's gonna be forty minus. 10%, so we're looking at 36 to recruit that, plus one for the card. All right, well, let's grab here. Drain the village of blood, get a recruit here. Grab the wolves, move the wolves to there. Okay, our army is reinforced. Let's go forward. Use a ranged unit. There's a ranged unit actually at the graveyard if we get mages. Okay. All right. It's only 13 eligible people signing up for the giveaway. Tom, you want to announce what they need to do to get into the giveaway? What does it involve? I don't know, what does it involve? All right, let's move to the ritual site. Take care of this fight, I guess. Can't auto resolve it, so we'll have to fight it. There is a, apparently another Lord there. I wasn't expecting there to be a Lord there. Sure, 12 mana, it's a bit low. Can I cancel and keep my actions? Because I kind of want mana back. All right, let's blood, pet, blood prep. Well. Except we could conquer the ritual site gives us upgraded mana. We can take one more fight without that, maybe. Oh wait, did I already cast it? Shit. Already cast it, never mind. Okay, now we'll fight. Typing anything in chat will make you eligible. Alright. So if you guys would like to be part of a free giveaway for keys for this game, in other words, if you looked at it and said, hey, this might be interesting. Say something in chat right now. There we go. I, I recommend in the future, Tom, making a keyword for that. It just makes it easier for people who are paying attention to opt in. All right. And I don't know why I haven't done this already. Why is Tom not a VIP? 
I think I have VIP slots left. So I don't remember. If, I think it removes mod status is why. Uh, maybe I won't do that. All right. In this particular fight, receiving damage ranks me up. Okay. All right. And the opponent by dealing damage ranks up, so it's not good. We got to kill their their caster. All right, but we have some tanks, just no archers, which is kind of a bummer. All right. Let's go forward. Ah, let's let them move forward first. And let's move the speed forward. Go. Can't help but notice their lord is blocked by a wall of units. All shall serve. What does this one do? This one gives me. Grants the ability to teleport. All right. It's supposed to receive damage. What is this? This is a champion. Overkill, repost, teleport, because he's standing on it, undying. Ignore pain. It's not sound like a unit I want to dump damage into right now. <laughs> unit gains protection for two turns. All right, there's our tank unit moving forward. Can probably handle those. Less excited about this Winners unit. Never win. Okay, the knight can get in range to do damage to the. That's another champion. Ew. Could also just charge it next turn. Doesn't do as much damage, but doesn't give it a counterattack. And what are we doing? We're trying to get to that lord. He's going to come back through here, but we're like blocked. Thank you, uh, Jeff O'Emmon, or Jeff of Minnesota, probably, for the uh, the resub. Ugh, this positioning's really rough on us. Cower before me. Guess if we drained it. It's pretty fucking tanky and it will respawn, right? Yeah, it takes 50% less damage from magic sources. Get a full flank worth of damage, but. Does that kill it? That says it kills it. So it respawns, it's fine. Gained health. Someone healed it. No! Blank on my warriors. It's an archer unit. Alright, can we actually kill this? No. Damn, why not? Is our mana at 12? I think we can kill it with all three though. That kills it, 
that triggers that. I wanted to give the kill to that unit for healing, but I don't, can't let it keep uh, we obey. keep surviving. Does this unit have a kill ability? So this thing has inspiring, adjacent units do damage, lifesteal 15%, shielded and shockwave. Nothing that gives it lifesteal on unit kills. Could try to back up. I think I'd rather do that. Yeah, that's not good. Alright, another close fight. Looks like it's okay right now. I bring the night. Brings it loudly. Like many other units in this game. Um Damage there is not terribly exciting. It's a bit more exciting when I do that. Are they undying? They might be. I don't think it matters. Okay, there's the undying hit. I could bloodlust and kill the Lord. It seems pretty good. Blood going ham. I think it kills it, but I don't think we procced its um, four movement. I don't think we procced its uh, its undying ability, and I don't want this unit taking any more damage. warriors being very unexceptional as per always i didn't i didn't read actually i'm kind of curious if any of my mods for example or any of the guy you guys who are interested uh who are also interested in this game has anyone checked out what the uh the balance changes were if any to the to this uh update patch tell them to go there I told them to, well actually I did but I screwed up the command undying archers kill them I think they can gives them a little bit of life still at the end there okay you <laughs> pro got you into eating hamburgers you've stopped going to the gym but continue eating hamburgers mm-hmm seems like a strat all right just came out of that. All of our units are alive. Good. Greater sacrifice is nice. We need the resources. Hit another uh, level up in the skill tree. Each spend point will give recruit action is now free. Tier 3 veteracies would be nice as well. Reduced unit cost. Pretty nice right about now. All right, let's take that. All right, I do want the mages from here. So let's claim this piece of land. 
So now we get improved uh, mana regen from that. It's a graveyard there, which I kind of want. Anything down this route? There's another village to capture in a library. What is this? This is month one of the year. So I don't need to spend Inspires right now. Three, six, nine. We're not on a full hand either. The only question is, will a unit engage us from out of the fog? Maybe. All right, let's run with um, Revitalize here. And claim this. Okay. Gives me four mana. It's going to be a pretty rough fight if we take this as a fight. Let's hope no unit pops out of the fog and attacks me. I don't know the uh, get balance I don't really like of this. Your vision range is one, but enemies cheat on vision, so they always see you. So they just charge out of the fog and attack you all the time. Super annoying. Although potentially true to uh, inspiration. All right, let's move to the village. I don't really care about the library. I don't need more cards right now. But I do care about potentially another ritual upgrade. Yeah, inspired of plus three movements, pretty nice. Let's capture the village. How big's the army? It's a pretty fucking big army. Does this mean there's no leader right now? Who's that ginormous ghoul there? Grab some blood. Could heal us all. I don't want to. Let's upgrade the village. It's, I mean, it's kind of a nice ability to be able to move further. And upgrading our cards is kind of nice. Can we take it with these four, though? Very annoying units because you can't block them. These are quite quick. And they fly, so you can't really block them. I mean... Can I sure, that'd be nice. Thanks. Problem is we have no mana, right? So because we have no mana, we have no ability to do anything except swing. Mm, all right. Like how people are food in this game? Yeah, you are playing vampires. All right, I can unlock archers gain 15 armor, no archers. Lord gains regeneration would be nice if Lord gains shielded. To do this, I have to heal units with cards or abilities for 50 health. Can't, no, okay. I don't know if abilities acquire, like every unit in my army basically has lifesteal. So I wonder if that counts or not, but um, I would like to set up for a long charge, which would be on Actually, not sure. I'm not sure if that blocks or not. It looks like it blocks. I still need a button that lets me see terrain during deployment because I have no idea if that unit blocks or not. Yeah. Looks like it does not block, so we can get a very nasty charge there. This unit has suicided into us. That's great. Seven mana only. 
Can you hover the objectives on the map to see what they do? These aren't objectives. These are the shrines. They buff you when you stand on the associated tiles with them. I can get in hitting that unit, which is pretty valuable to us. Thought I turned the speed up. I did. Alright, so I can take a charge on the ghost swarm. I bring the night! And get a full flank on this unit if I want, which I do. Turn to decide if I want to spend mana making him do more damage. I don't think I do. Okay. Are they playable in the new patch? Yeah, but you have to to get to their campaign, you have to beat this campaign. So this is the final mission of the first campaign. Uh, who goes next? This unit will go ahead of our units if we don't do something about it. Heal units with cards or abilities to rank up. We're at 18 of 50, so presumably our natural lifesteal counts. Should probably be a bloodlust here. happy to back up and charge again next turn these are our warriors go help there mm, they're faster than I was expecting charging my lord is fine don't even care Maybe regenerate some mana if they want to fight me over here. They might not want to fight me over here is the only problem. I guess we'll just go there and do damage to the knight. Face the might of the Dracul. All right, get a kill. Kill gives us another attack. Just gained uh, the first level from healing off our attacks. Oh wait, so it scales up on each of them. So it's always healing, but the first one's 50, then 75. Okay, it's a new mechanic. Guess we kill that. If I go there, we get flanked. If I go there, we control it a little bit better. Could let them move in and attack. I'm alright with that too. Don't mind if they flank my werewolves. Werewolves are super tanky. Alright, so I don't really want to fight their monstrosity with this unit. I can go help the knights attack this unit. Uh, Lord can get the kill. Lord gains regenerate, nice. Don't want this unit getting focused down. Not sure I have an option. Oh, I can full kill that? What the hell is this unit? Stalker. It's a level 2 unit. Does quite high damage, but looks very squishy. All right. Lord, we obey. Shockwave those guys. We're a little beat up on this unit. How fast are they? Speed three, so I can get them to attack the knights. They'll probably flank the knight with these two units. This unit doesn't heal. It's not true, it life steals. But I'd like to be out of range of them. There, I guess. I am willing to. Is this mana? No. Guess I'm willing to engage their tanky unit with my tanky unit. It's fine. Alright, we can get a full flank going there, or a full flank going there. These units are slow, it makes sense to me to just walk away from them. Let's go there, focus this unit down. Okay. 
Hopefully. Hopefully. I bring the night. Mm-hmm. Don't mind setting up a nice charge. Both these units have regeneration now, so each of them regens 10% HP start of each turn. No, no rush to use other the units to take damage. Rule over all. At your service. Can engage that with the healing unit. Yeah, they've upped Vlad's volume. Questionable decision for sure. Yes, my lord. I like the werewolf unit too. It's a nice big blocker tank unit. Shall serve. Need to be able to turn down individually. So we can get quite a lot of um, life steal. This unit has executioner and flanker. So it's doing 66% extra damage versus this unit. In addition to whatever the flanking bonus is. And then, so the flanking bonus, and then it gets it gets only 15% life steal, so it doesn't get kills off last hits. But it's still gonna be a big chunk of life back from that because it just hits so hard. I do not mind moving my wolves in. The blood calls. Blood is life. Lord, we obey. Face the might of the Dracul. Great. Alright, so we didn't actually lose that much there. Spent only one spell, lost some life off of our the unit I accidentally recruited, the warrior unit. That's so garbage. I wish I had gotten two knights instead. Well. Okay. Uh, take another greater sack. Oh, we get them both, right? Double card selection, keep forgetting. All right, upgrade off of our um, tech tree. I'm gonna grab another barter in blood. We're still recruiting here. So I'm gonna just end the turn here. I don't wanna waste um, one of the action points from Spire from capturing the site. So we'll just, we're not at 10 cards, so we're good. Don't have to discard. All right. Turn 10. We have to be done by turn 45 is the, the win con right now. All right, let's claim the ritual site, get access to upgraded uh, greater inspires. I want to go through... Um, where's my other recruitment area? It's not the library, it's the... Hey, don't I? I thought I had a mage recruitment site here. In fact, I know I do. Is it there, I guess? No, it's right, it's right there. Okay. All right. I don't know what the hell's going on. Sure. Gain 20 blood points, 44. Um, we can double recruit next turn. Double recruit now if we want. Pick up two of the mages. They're loud, but they do pretty good damage. Thing is, I can recruit manually here and recruit at range from the keep. Kind of want one more knight. I don't know if I want one more night or not. Probably want one more werewolf. Double werewolf blocker units have been very good. All right, let's do that now. We'll mobilize from the forest so they can catch up. Grab a werewolf. Go to here. Call it a turn. All 
All right. Move to the Lord. Join the army. 20. It's going to cost us how much to recruit? I think we're just a little short, right? I guess I can recruit next turn from there using the card. All right. I do want two mages. So I was hoping to get one now and one later from the recruitment card, but I can get another mobilize in a minute. This is the end of the year. It'd be nice to get uh, potentially like a feed card. To do that, I have to win a fight. They're 32, another 10% off them, still 29. So we're nowhere near it. All right, looks like we're only gonna get, looks like picking up that second wolf means we're not getting that mage right now. All right, I don't see another keep in here. There must be though. I don't I shouldn't have to take all of these, but that said, there's a village right there. So I guess I'll claim along the way so I can capture the village. I can't, you can't cap, you have to cap, capture in order territory wise, unless you can capture a keep. A keep gives you like a location to start capturing from. So my, my territory can be split up with uh, neutral lands or hostile lands as long as I keep taking keeps. But I don't know where any other keeps are over here. So. I'm not going to feed on the village. I'm going to capture it and recruit from it. An intruder, master. I am loyal to you, master. I will never let them take your halls, my king. What is that thing? A vampire? Who is this master of which you speak? All right. So enemy army there has a lord. Full army. Pretty weak units, though. Okay. Um, we're going to Greater Inspire. So that is a keep there. Could drain the village, could upgrade the village, could do both. But I definitely want to do it now, so I have the income off the village for next, for the, the beginning of, or the rather the growth. You get income every single turn, but the growth of a village uh, changes based on, or rather only grows once per year, so... We'll claim this. I could directly just drain it for blood, which I might. But I might just double upgrade it instead. All right, that'll grow to five now, which is its max. Uh, I think I'm just going to take this fight right now. And then claim it at the start of the round. Okay, it's going to be kind of a rough fight. I have how much mana? Like none. All right, should be fun. Yeah. So we have double werewolf, knight, wounded uh, warrior only. Okay, with no mana. All right, Lord gains regeneration and shielded, and I have to auto heal. Okay. That one gives me mana on attacks. So that might be a good corridor to fight from, and this gives blood drinker, which is uh, healing on kills. I am gonna want the, I need to kill their Lord. He's ranged, which is annoying. And he's going to level up his enemies. So we're going to have to push through over there. His lord is pretty quick, though. So maybe he comes forward. So I want to give him someone to come forward to. So I'm going to run my lord up this side. I'd like to get one of the werewolves fighting on that tile, probably. And maybe we can hold space with this werewolf there. And set up charges down this long corridor here. Seems okay. I need to turn the game speed up. Their Lord delayed, that's annoying. I 
So you're getting some weird kind of almost like lag in the game right now. The blood calls. I crave more. Huh. Why am I getting lag? If there's a memory leak in this now. Remind me after this to save and come back in. Alright. Um, definitely want to get fighting in here. I don't want to fight the champion particularly. This is a ranged unit annoyingly. I could wait, let them come forward, and then try to move around the back to get on their lord. I want to kill their lord immediately. Waiting on what? Is this a freeze? We haven't had it hang on a combat sequence before. The update ad introduced some new bugs. Oh, that's annoying. Okay. Yeah, it means we're going to have to start the fight again, though. Restart the game as well. Getting some kind of weird uh, delays with it. Too bad. I kind of was liking how that map with that fight was setting up. The theater of war. All right, campaign menu, load campaign, auto save. That was seven minutes ago. Okay. What's with my wristband? That's a wristband, friend? What does like a, like a sleeve look like if that's a wristband? Um, it's repetitive stress uh, from too much time on the computer. That's what that is. All right, where are we? So this is that turn. Okay, so here we grab the wolf. And then we went one. We did capture this, but now we have better information. That's a keep. We could just walk into their keep and capture it. But I did upgrade the village and it was kind of useful. So I think we just take the same order. All right, we claim this. Go there. An intruder, master. I am loyal Cancel to there. Your Lovely voice acting. Cast greater inspire. Claim this. Double upgrade it. And then walk in there and take their keep from them. I'm going to do a quick save here. Okay. And hope it doesn't hang on whatever action they take there. Is this a Warhammer game? It looks like Warhammer. Uh, no, it's much closer to Heroes of Might and Magic. Ooh, we gained Soul Drain, which is um, mana on kills, I think. Tanks gain 20% attack, Lord gains 25% attack. So we're this is actually a very good set of cards for us here. It's kind of like, um, yeah, as I said, it's, it's, it's a little similar to Heroes of Might and Magic, right? You're capturing um, 
territories which give you things you recruit armies you have lords that level all your units level your lords level you have a tech tree as well as a uh, as magic from your lords it's, it's fairly interesting actually all right i'm not sure i'm actually gonna be able to take advantage of that but i'd like to get a werewolf in over there I feel like charges are going to happen on this this row too, maybe. These guys are going to hide. The lords can come up this way. Like that, I guess. Alright. Okay, there's the summon. The blood call. block too much of that. I'm going to get on this row for a charge. Alright, I can run through there and start attacking. I'm fine with this. Lore and aesthetics wise. Uh, I think it's just generic vampire lore. I think. I'm not sure there's any Warhammer style stuff. See, this isn't good. I don't know what this waiting is. But I can't advance past this, though, if it hangs every single time on here. Thank you, Anti-Condor, for the 13 months. Yeah, um... But this is all gated, right? The next campaign is gated on beating this campaign. Alright, um, I think there's a console. I wonder if there's like a console command past this. Also, do we have the dev in the channel by chance? Hmm. Well, let me just see. Thought something changed. We'll give it a second. Maybe it's just an extremely long turn processing for that unit, but I don't think so. I think it's bugged. And I don't know quite what we do to get past that. I can avoid this keep, I guess. But what happens if he attacks me and he gets a turn? It's going to be very awkward, huh? Can you console win the mission? I don't know what the console commands are. I feel like I've opened the console in this game before, but maybe I'm not entirely remembering correctly. It's a bit of a bummer. I want to see the new faction today. That was the point, so. All right, we'll try um, avoiding that. So reload this one. This is the older one. I mean, I can just walk away from that unit and leave a... I don't really want to leave an army behind me, and I don't really want to not capture that keep, but I may not be given that option. So we can go here, and instead of um, engaging with this guy, we can drain it, drain the village. And then we can move past. Okay. All right, we've got another forest, another cave, and a village. Is there a keep over by this village? No, I'm just gonna drain this village as well. A large swarm of bats. Not terribly excited. Is that a keep? That looks keepish to me. Either way, I'm not getting the village this turn, so we'll drain it.
Do we want to fight a shit ton of bats? Uh, I do. Okay. I'm going to try Alder's Blood release today. I've never heard of it. Is a bat lord? Oh, fuck. You're always welcome to suggest games on my Discord. We do through a fairly large number of games on this channel. All right, uh, receive damage to rank up. Pretty unexciting bonuses. Yeah. All right, Batlord. He's got 242 health. These are actually really tanky units, 173. Okay. She wouldn't mind putting that unit right there. Rampage. 40% attack and overkill for the turn. I think it's only one turn though, right? The blood calls. I crave more. If I don't want this unit to be massively flanked repeatedly, it will die doing it, but that is the tile I want it on. Kills giving it life steal. Or giving it life back. Alright, we can get an attack off there, seems good. Tanky. Alright, I can charge that and kill it. All shall serve. He's still buffed though. I think. He isn't. So they buffed him after he'd done something. Thing is, this unit is going to get focused if I leave a bunch of tiles by it. I can't stop the bats from moving, though. I might just end up losing this unit, which might be what happens here. I don't do shit to that bat. Does it regenerate? Heals for life when it kills a unit. All right, I guess we're killing everything else, then. Magic protection on that unit. Okay. Flanking the wolf is fine. Can't charge again this turn. They likely set up on that. Let's wait. Ow, that hit very hard. Don't ever do that again, thanks. All right, we got 11 mana. Is there any way we can get heals on this unit? We'd have to do damage there. Is this thing going to be able to reach us? Speed of five. One off. This focus. No. Okay. Actually, this worked out okay. All right, let's get our full flank here. Uh, we can either take a partial flank. Here. We can either take a full flank here and be full flank. If the Lord kills it next turn, though, it won't. So we'll take our full flank there, I guess. Wolf is getting a little beat up. Um, and shockwave that unit. To not take damage. I don't know if that heals us though. Looks like it doesn't. Uh, 
All right, new round, hoping to kill this. Does look like that's a kill. We do 59 of its 51. That gives us a second attack to kill that unit. Looks pretty good. Okay. Flank themselves. Good. This is our unit. I can get in there and kill that, apparently. I don't want to kill that. I want to kill it with this unit. Who goes next? What unit is this? Highlights are awkward. There's something changing when I highlight, but I'm not sure what it is. Box, but where is the highlight box for them? Where is this unit? This unit is speed five. I think it's that unit. It does seem to be highlighting, right? Changes just pulses slightly when I mouse there. Okay, so we're gonna attack there. I can kite that unit by backing up, I can't kite this unit. And if I move over this way, this unit will kill me next round. Not sure that matters. They're beating the shit out of my wolf. I wasn't expecting the werewolf to die, but I'm not sure I can actually keep that alive anymore. The Dracul shall rule over all. Ah, ah dude, two health. Okay. So I can kill that, and it is going next, so I guess that's the plan. But this guy can't ever get a last hit in to heal. Lord, we this has been obey. super bad news. Counterattack will kill me there. Get back way up. Werewolf still alive, surprisingly. Can't stop their lord from sniping that unit if it wants to. And it does heal off sniping a unit. So presumably not super valuable. All right, let's set up to give him a chance to keep that unit alive. I'll do damage here to set up for the, um, the cav getting a big heal off of it. Werewolves tanking like bosses. Oh, I'm stuck on that tile? Fuck. Cower before me. Alright, 
a chance that this unit lives. Okay. Quite in range of the Lord, unfortunately. Okay, we getting that again is really good. I think the werewolf lives now. All right, I'm gonna walk out of this with no units lost. Do I have life stealing here? Regeneration, overkill, lunge, terror. No. Okay. Blood. Really surprised we didn't lose two units there. Them not chasing us as flyers was quite nice. Okay. Mana back, more movement. We have 32 blood. Um, I would like to, we've already drained the village, right? No, we're head, yeah, we came from the village, we drained it. We're looking for a, another keep, which might be there. This is probably gonna be a full heal since two of my, three of my units are super wounded. Right. Then let's move forward. That is another keep. So great, we'll go take the keep. More armies are approaching. We need to hurry before we get swarmed. Another army here. Any reason not to take that army? I don't think so. I would like to recruit some mages, but I don't know when the hell we're gonna do that. I can't really, I mean, I guess I can walk this way now to connect my armies. I have a weakened mage here, but I never upgraded the building on the way out. Well, fail. Didn't we upgrade one of these somewhere? I really thought we did. As soon as I rotate the camera, I immediately get lost where I was. Chat, do you guys remember me taking one of the mage locations? I feel like I did. But I think it was this location and it really doesn't look like I did. Rip. Well, no reason to keep not keep fighting this round. We have, um, we can refill mana and keep going. All right. All right, heal to gain these abilities, sure. Actually do have a Lord. All shall serve. Okay, that's a good spot for us. We can charge that spot. Happy to move in with this unit. Happy to turn the game speed up. Not 
sure how far in I want to move with this unit. Probably not that far. Or oh, one tile off a charge. Feels bad. The Dracul shall rule over all. All right, new round. Is this mana regen? No, it's initiative. Oops, where's my bloodstorm? All right, get a full charge on their leader. The blood calls. I crave more. We'll hang out. So here they go. Flanking my leader. I think that's okay with us still. As long as we don't lose Vlad here, we're in good shape. Tanks a lot. He's very tanky. He does a lot of damage. He's getting the shit kicked out of him. Amazing. All right. Let's do a bloodlust. Not a bloodlust. A life steal for him. Great. And then let's flank this thing. Thank you, little dude. This is their undying champions. They look really weak. So it looks like a single unit, but it is quite nasty. And I guess we're giving life steal to Vlad so he doesn't fucking die. More mana than I wanted to spend on this fight. Doesn't kill it. What? It's very hard. Lord, we obey. <laughs> Guess I have to soften them up with the units that heal. Blood is life. Line. Yeah, I think a lot of damage on units. I didn't want to do that because I gotta protect the Lord. Still getting shot by fucking archers. We are life stealing off this. not immense amounts this undying thing is quite annoying for enemy units for um ai units comes back and i have to kill it 12 times Cool shall rule over all. Oh, he's back again. It's exciting. I think every unit in there uh, once it procs once. Every unit in their army except their lord came back after death. Well, full mana replenish is really nice, and recruitment discount at range is pretty nice too. Pick up another level on our gear. Village max population by one and city max population by one. 
It's okay. That mind strength on our lord. Some mana regen there. Let's attack 